I'm here at the 2007 Steve Mulberry with the uh, oldest player in the tournament, Bobby Garcia. I'm just, Bobby go! I just have a couple questions. Uh, how does it feel the oldest be the oldest player in this league to uh, tear a lot of young bloods up? I've been wanting to say that for years. I appreciate the blessing. Uh, you know, I've been playing in this league since 1992. My man Bill Lynch, Tom, you know, everybody else has been involved with it. Hardy, who did a rough assignment back in the day, my man Horse. And uh, what's up? And um, you know, it's just a, it's, for me, it's one of my favorite leagues in New York City, and uh, that's why I keep on coming back year after year after year after year. Uh, took second place three years, never won a championship. I don't even care about it at this point. I'm not here to win. Just out here to have a good time. You know, most of the guys on my team are like in their late thirties, and um, you know, it's just a great atmosphere. You can't beat it. I got two more quick questions. Uh, one, how's it feel to uh, have the tables? I've come with a few questions now instead of the those questions. I always want to ask that. Well, yeah, I, uh, I've been doing interviews for years. I was on radio on WKCR 89.9 FM, um, dating back to 1990 to 2002. Currently, I'm doing interviews for MSB Network for the next halftime, for Hot Minute to Half. And uh, I did Vibe Magazine for 12 years, interviews, so, you know, it's fun doing the interviews, but, you know, it's nice to be on the, on the flip side, particularly when I got, I got a, you know, a dude that's intelligent and genius level with my man Bill Lynch. Okay, the last thing um, I'd like to say, how does it feel? To me, you're like the best role model in the league. The best uh, what? You're the best role model in the league for a lot of these kids, uh, more than me. Because, uh, you know, you do a lot of great things, like Bounce Magazine and everything like that. And you treat these kids um, just like you're on your own. So, I know all these kids got bad respect for him, so to me, just uh, how does it feel to be the meet uh, number one favorite in the tournament? Um, so, well, I mean, first of all, you got to give out respect to receive it. And, you know, whether these kids know me or not, you know, I say what's up to everybody. I always show respect to the refs and other teams. And uh, in 2002, uh, I won the first ever Stephen Mulberry um, Sportsmanship Award for the league. And, uh, you know, I think that's that's inherent in, in my character, you know, when I'm on a train and a homeless person addresses me, I show them the safe respect that I would show a CEO of a, a corporation. So, you know, I think that's why kids show me so much love. I mean, also, they see me on TV and video games, so I think it's nice for them to see me out here in the community, you know. No different than them. And this guy's from LES anyway, right? So, yeah. I'm, well, I'm from Uptown, but I lived in the LES for 15 years, so I'll wrap it to the coast. Okay, so uh, right. I'd like to thank the best, greatest gentleman in the world, and I'll right. thank you very much. Yeah. 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 Yeah.